Now, a number of South Shore school superintendents are urging Governor Charlie Baker to accelerate the vaccine schedule for certain school personnel. They believe, among other things, it'll speed up a full-time student return to the classroom. Here's WBZ's Tiffany Chan. With phase one of the state's vaccination plan underway, there's a growing demand by several industries to get a dose before the general public. Joseph Russo has been running his funeral home in Roslindale for more than half a century. When families can't go in and a death happens, we have to go in. In a pandemic, the 70-year-old and his staff have had a tough job coming into contact with the deceased, going into hospitals, nursing facilities. And you guys go into homes as well. Oh, definitely. And because of the risks, Russo is joining the push to get funeral directors and staff vaccinated now alongside first responders, or they could be waiting until March. Understand that we provide a essential role and we should be in that first category. He's not the only one eager for the COVID-19 shot. K through 12 educators want their vaccine sooner too, since they'll be working with students in person. Every day that passes is a day that kids are not in the classroom. Several South Shore superintendents are calling on the governor to release their doses ahead of phase two so they can get it into the arms of teachers with no delays. Rockland School Superintendent Alan Cron. We have freezers, we have nurses, we are ready to go. We have the capacity. Um, Getting teachers back, um, getting kids back to school full time is, is a priority. In turn, they believe it'll free up space at the mass vaccination sites. Russo and Cron tell us they don't want to fight overdoses, they just want to do their job safely. This vaccine is our best shot. Let's do it now. Governor Baker recently allowing other non COVID facing health care workers like dentists and chiropractors to be included in phase one if they choose to be. From Roslindale, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.